I'm scared. Why are you scared? Because it's going to be yucky. I need help. Today has been a little weird. I think it's because I haven't been outside in like two days straight. We, we've like been around, but not really had a chance to get outside. I know, look at that fun water. Isn't that pretty? Well, maybe not super pretty, but it's cute. So when my friend Alexa texted uh, me and Emily to come play at the park right now, I was like, yes, please. So we picked up Porter and woke up Piper from her nap. And we are here at the park to play and it's so gorgeous. It's like, prime fall right now guys here in Provo I just there's a we had a little bit of some rain this morning um which I was really scared was going to turn into like this huge storm and get rid of all of our leaves but I think most of the trees survived so I'll show you guys some of the gorgeous trees here at this park you gonna go play A lot of fun and we're home now and it's time for dinner. Porter thinks he's gonna watch a movie, but I think he's gonna play with toys. Yo. Like no. What's it called, Piper? Potato. No, not potato. 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 Good. No, don't be careful. I don't want you stabbing your nose. Piper, take a bite. Now. You need to take a bite too. It's just potatoes and eggs and meat. Where's the meat? The meat's kind of mixed in. Seriously, it's not that bad. It's just potato. It's super yummy. <laughs> Hearty. Mm. And there's like tons of ketchup on it, so it's super sweet too. I don't want it. What? <laughs> Piper likes it. Piper, take a bite. Let me see you take a bite. I have to stretch out because I like, take a long nap. You didn't even take a nap today. <laughs> this is a meal my mom would make. It was like one of her standard like rotating meals. But it's just Hi. fried potatoes. Hi. It's just fried potatoes, some eggs, and um, onions, and ground beef. You just cook it all together and it's like one big pot meal. I'm making some biscuits too. I was gonna steam some veggies, but I ended up not doing that. So me and Piper are gonna eat lots of biscuits because we're eating our dinner. But Porter might not get any. Mommy, I need help. You don't need help. You're four years old. You can eat your own food. You're not a baby. A baby. No, let me see you try it. I just fed you one. You can try your own. Oh. Well, then eat. What? I'm scared. Why are you scared? Because it's going to be yucky. That's not a reason to be scared. You already tried it. Was it yucky?
<laughs> Why are you making? Love is a battlefield, right? We're having a little showing of Down Abbey while we're eating. Not as hard as it is for me. No you better not pout. I'm telling you why Santa Claus is coming. Tell it. Okay, no, I don't. But what do? But what do? What do you want? Santa Claus is coming. Okay, I have issues with like these stainless steel pa pots and pans. They're stainless steel, right? Like this kind? Um, I cannot cook anything in them <laughs> because I always burn the pan. I mean, look at that. It's like super nasty. It's just like, uh, and it cleans off eventually, but like, I need help. Why does this always happen? I cook it on like low. I don't, and I'm not cooking it on high or anything enough that it like burns it. Like I thought that that's what I was trying to do hard, really hard to do this time was to make sure I put it on like medium heat so that I don't burn it because that was usually my issue. I just was impatient with cooking, right? <sighs> anyway, those pans frustrate me. I need help. I wish I could take a cooking class because I I need it really bad. Alrighty, the kids are asleep and Zach has like a lot of work to do, so he's just working on stuff. Say hi to everybody. Hello. I am just so exhausted. Like it was a totally great day, but then I guess, you know, and you're going, going, going all day long and then you sit down and it's like, I haven't sat down all day. Um, so I'm just really tired. I'm going to watch YouTube or Netflix or something for a couple minutes and then probably go to bed. We will see you tomorrow. Bye. Say bye. Bye finding out what the gender was. So I was a little upset, but at the same time, I was kind of happy that we got to just do that with ourselves, um, with me and Zach in the room, um, to find out what the gender was. And we are so excited to be having a boy. We could not be happier.